Once upon a time, in a big, dark sky, there lived a little star named Twinkle. Twinkle was a very tired star who had been shining brightly for a long, long time. Every night, Twinkle would light up the night sky, spreading her soft, gentle glow to help everyone see in the dark. But, you see, even stars need their rest. And Twinkle was ready for some peaceful, sleepy time. She looked down at the world below and wished upon a shooting star for a little bit of rest. One night, as Twinkle was twinkling away, she saw something magical. It was a kind, old moon named Luna. Luna had a wise and comforting smile, and she whispered to Twinkle. My dear, it's time to rest your sparkly light. Twinkle felt so relieved. With Luna's gentle guidance, she slowly dimmed her glow and started to feel lighter and cozier. Luna told her a bedtime story about the moon and the stars, and it was the sweetest lullaby. The soft words wrapped around Twinkle like a warm, comfy blanket. As Twinkle closed her eyes, Luna sang the sleepiest song, and Twinkle drifted into a deep, dreamy slumber. In her dreams, she danced among the other stars, making wishes and sharing stories. The world below was grateful for the restful night and the quiet, peaceful sleep. They whispered their thanks to Twinkle and Luna for watching over them. And so, night after night, Twinkle would twinkle and then cozy up to Luna for a good night's sleep. The world was happy, and Twinkle was happy, knowing that even the brightest stars need their rest. Now, my dear listener, as you listen to this sleepy story, it's time for you to close your eyes and snuggle up in your cozy bed. Just like Twinkle and Luna, you deserve a night full of sweet dreams and peaceful slumber. The world is safe and sound, and you are surrounded by the love of the night. Good night, dear one. The Sleepy Meadow Once upon a time, in a faraway land, there was a peaceful meadow. This meadow was unlike any other, it was a place where the flowers sang lullabies, and the grasses swayed gently in the evening breeze. In this magical meadow, there lived a little bunny named Benny. Benny was a soft, fluffy bunny with floppy ears and a heart full of curiosity. Every day, he hopped around the meadow, exploring the world around him and making friends with the creatures that called the meadow home. But, as the sun began to set, and the sky turned a warm, dusky orange, Benny felt a soft, gentle tiredness wash over him. It was the kind of tiredness that felt like a cozy blanket, wrapping around you, inviting you to rest. Benny hopped to his favorite spot in the meadow, a soft, grassy knoll under a twinkling, silver moon. There, he nestled into the soft grass, looking up at the stars that began to appear, one by one. The stars were like nightlight fireflies, winking at Benny as if telling him it was time for dreams. The meadow itself seemed to sigh a soft, soothing melody. The breeze whispered through the tall grasses, and the flowers hummed their sweet lullabies. The world around Benny was getting ready for sleep, and he felt its warm embrace. As Benny closed his eyes, he thought of all the wonderful things he had seen that day, the busy ants, the friendly ladybugs, and the tall, wise trees. It was a day full of magic, and now it was time to let his dreams take flight. In the distance, the frogs by the meadow's pond began to sing their chorus. It was a gentle, soothing song that seemed to carry Benny away to dreamland. The fireflies danced, their soft, twinkling lights casting a gentle glow on Benny's furry cheeks. And so, with the stars above, the meadow's lullabies, and the moonlight's tender touch, Benny drifted into the sweetest slumber. He dreamt of all the adventures that awaited him tomorrow. Now, dear listener, just like Benny in the meadow, it's time for you to close your eyes and snuggle into your cozy bed. The world is settling into its dreams and you are surrounded by the peace of the night. May your dreams be as magical as the meadow and may you wake up to a day full of wonder.
Once upon a time, in a cozy little village nestled beside a shimmering lake, there lived a kind-hearted rabbit named Oliver. Oliver loved to explore the world around him and make new friends. Every evening, as the golden sun dipped below the horizon, Oliver would hop through the meadows, spreading joy and happiness wherever he went. One beautiful evening, as the moon began to rise and sprinkle its gentle light across the land, Oliver decided to embark on a special adventure. He wanted to find the most soothing and comforting place in the entire village where both children and adults could find solace and tranquility. With his fluffy tail bobbing behind him, Oliver hopped through the village, asking his animal friends for their suggestions. The wise old owl, perched high on a tree branch, suggested a quiet grove with soft, mossy beds. The gentle ladybug suggested a field of delicate flowers, where their sweet fragrance would lull everyone to sleep. And the playful squirrels recommended a peaceful meadow, where the tall grass swayed gently in the breeze. Oliver listened carefully to each suggestion, his big, floppy ears capturing every word. He thanked his friends and set off to find the perfect spot blending all their ideas together. As he hopped along, he noticed a hidden path leading to a magical place he had never seen before. The path led him to a serene garden filled with twinkling fireflies and delicate butterflies. The air was filled with the scent of lavender and chamomile, carrying a sense of calmness and peace. The flowers, in every color imaginable, seemed to dance in harmony, creating a soothing symphony of colors. Oliver hopped further into the garden, discovering a small, cozy cottage nestled among the flowers. The cottage was made of warm wooden beams and had a thatched roof covered in soft moss. Inside, a crackling fireplace illuminated the room with a warm glow, casting gentle shadows on the walls. Oliver knew he had found the perfect place. He invited all his friends, from the wise owl to the friendly ladybug and the playful squirrels, to join him in this haven of tranquility. They all gathered around the fireplace, their hearts filled with joy and contentment. As the night grew darker, Oliver began to tell a magical story, filled with adventure, friendship, and dreams. His soft, soothing voice mingled with the crackling of the fire, wrapping everyone in a cozy blanket of comfort. The gentle rhythm of his words carried them into a world of dreams, where anything was possible. One by one, the animals nestled into their mossy beds, their eyelids growing heavy with sleep. The moon smiled down upon them, casting a gentle glow over the garden as Oliver's voice whispered through the night, guiding them into a peaceful slumber. And so, in that enchanting garden, surrounded by the love and warmth of friends, both young and old found solace and serenity. The soothing words of Oliver's bedtime story echoed in their dreams, bringing them comfort and peace each and every night. As the sun rose on a new day, the animals awoke refreshed and renewed. They knew that whenever they needed a moment of tranquility, they could return to that magical garden, where Oliver's gentle voice and comforting stories would always be waiting. And from that day forward, the village embraced the gift of Oliver's bedtime stories, cherishing the moments of peace and tranquility they brought. And so, dear friends, as you close your eyes tonight, may Oliver's soothing words carry you away to that magical garden where dreams come alive and a peaceful slumber awaits. Sleep tight, and may your dreams be filled with love and happiness. Once upon a time, in a quiet little village, there lived a gentle bear named Benny. Benny loved to explore the world around him and make new friends. Every evening, as the golden sun disappeared behind the mountains, Benny would stroll through the meadows, spreading kindness and joy wherever he went. One beautiful evening, as the moon rose high in the sky, Benny decided to embark on a special adventure. He wanted to find the coziest, most soothing place in the entire village, a place where both children and grown-ups could find comfort and peace. With his furry paws padding softly on the ground, Benny walked through the village, asking his animal friends for their suggestions. 
The wise old owl perched on a branch, suggested a quiet nook under a tall, shady tree. The chirpy little birds suggested a nest made of soft, fluffy feathers, where dreams could take flight. And the playful squirrels recommended a warm, sunlit meadow, where daisies danced in the gentle breeze. Benny listened carefully to each suggestion, his big, round ears capturing every word. He thanked his friends and set off to find the perfect spot, blending all their ideas together. As he walked along, he noticed a hidden trail leading to a magical place he had never seen before. The trail led him to a peaceful garden, filled with twinkling fireflies and colorful butterflies. The air was filled with the sweet scent of flowers, carrying a sense of calmness and tranquility. The flowers in every shade of the rainbow swayed gently in the soft, warm breeze. Then he walked further into the garden, discovering a cozy cottage nestled among the flowers. The cottage was made of smooth, warm stones and had a thatched roof covered in soft moss. Inside, a crackling fireplace cast a warm glow, creating flickering shadows on the walls. Benny knew he had found the perfect place. He invited all his friends, from the wise owl to the chirpy birds and the playful squirrels, to join him in this haven of peace. They all gathered around the fireplace, their hearts filled with joy and tranquility. As the night grew darker, Benny began to tell a magical story, filled with adventure, friendship, and dreams. His soft, soothing voice blended with the crackling fire, wrapping everyone in a cozy blanket of comfort. The gentle rhythm of his words carried them away into a world of imagination, where worries melted away. One by one, the animals nestled into their soft nests, their eyes growing heavy with sleep. The moon smiled down upon them, casting a warm glow over the garden, as Benny's voice whispered through the night, guiding them into a restful slumber. And so, in that enchanted garden, surrounded by the love and warmth of friends, both young and old found solace and serenity. Benny's bedtime stories became a cherished tradition, bringing peace and comfort to the village. Each night, as the stars twinkled in the sky, Benny's soothing words echoed through their dreams, carrying them to a world of gentle sleep. As the sun rose on a new day, the animals awoke refreshed and renewed. They knew that whenever they needed a moment of tranquility, they could return to that magical garden where Benny's gentle voice and comforting stories would always be waiting. Once upon a time, in a sleepy little village nestled among rolling green hills, there lived a young girl named Lily. Lily was known for her kind heart and gentle spirit. Every evening as the golden sun dipped below the horizon, casting a warm glow across the land, Lily's grandmother would share with her magical bedtime stories that would transport her to dreamland. One particular evening, as Lily snuggled under her cozy covers, she eagerly awaited her grandmother's soothing voice. Tonight, her grandmother had a special story to share, one that would bring peace and tranquility to all who listened. Once in a land far away, where the moon shone bright like a radiant pearl, there lived a wise old owl named Oliver, began Lily's grandmother. Oliver was known throughout the forest for his wisdom and his ability to bring comfort to those in need. Oliver spent his days perched high in a tall oak tree, observing the world below. He would listen to the gentle rustle of the leaves, the soft chirping of the birds, and the distant hum of the river. With his keen eyes and deep understanding, he watched over the woodland creatures, ensuring their safety and well-being. One night, as a gentle breeze whispered through the trees, Oliver sensed a feeling of unease spreading across the forest. The animals grew restless, their fur and feathers ruffled with worry. Oliver knew he had to find a way to ease their fears and bring back the calm that once enveloped the woods. With a wise heart and a twinkle in his eyes, Oliver decided to embark on a journey. 
He flew from tree to tree, spreading his comforting wisdom and reassurance. He spoke to the squirrels, assuring them that the acorns would always fall plentifully from the branches. He whispered to the rabbits, telling them tales of the lush meadows where they could freely hop and play. As Oliver traveled deeper into the forest, he encountered a timid little fawn named Daisy. Her eyes were filled with tears and her delicate hooves trembled with fear. Oliver gently perched on a nearby branch and began to share stories of courage and strength. He told Daisy about the stars that shone brightly in the night sky, guiding her path through the darkness. He spoke of the moon, a constant companion, watching over her as she slept. With every word he spoke, Daisy felt a sense of calm wash over her, and her fears began to fade away. Oliver's journey continued and he encountered creatures big and small, each in need of his comforting presence. With every encounter, he spread his warmth and love, bringing solace to all. Finally, as the first light of dawn peeked over the horizon, Oliver made his way back to his tree. The forest was now filled with a peaceful silence, and the animals slept soundly, cradled by the serenity that had been restored. As Lily's grandmother finished the story, the room was filled with a gentle hush. Lily's eyelids grew heavy, and a sense of tranquility washed over her. She closed her eyes feeling safe and secure, as if Oliver himself were watching over her. And so, with hearts full of peace and minds filled with dreams, Lily and all who heard Oliver's tale drifted off into a peaceful slumber, knowing that in the embrace of sleep, they would find comfort and serenity. And as the night sky sparkled with stars, Oliver continued to watch over the world, his wisdom and love reaching every corner, bringing peaceful dreams to all who needed them. Sleep tight, dear ones, and may the gentle whispers of Oliver's wisdom guide you through the night. In a tranquil corner of the world, there nestled a quiet village called Whispering Pines. This village was a haven of serenity, where the gentle rustling of the trees seemed to whisper secrets of peace and dreams. At the heart of Whispering Pines stood a cozy timber cottage, and within it lived a kind soul named Hush. Hush was the village's keeper of dreams, known for her ability to craft the most peaceful and restful dreams for all who sought a night of calm slumber. Every evening, as the sun dipped below the horizon, Hush would prepare her haven for the night. Soft, golden lanterns adorned the trees, casting a warm, inviting glow that mimicked the gentlest firefly's light. The village knew this was the signal it was time to gather and welcome the night. Children and adults, families and friends, all converged in the village square, their hearts filled with the promise of a tranquil night. They knew Hush's gift was a treasure to be cherished. As the first stars began to twinkle in the night sky, Hush began her gentle storytelling. Her voice was like the softest breeze, carrying the promise of a night of sweet dreams and peaceful sleep. Hush spoke of a world where moonbeams painted the landscape in silvery hues, and the night air was filled with the scent of wildflowers. In this dream, the village of Whispering Pines was a sanctuary of serenity. Children laughed, dancing amid fireflies while adults strolled through meadows adorned with blossoms. The sky above was painted with a tapestry of stars, each one whispering tales of tranquility. The wind itself seemed to hold its breath, ensuring that the dream remained undisturbed. As Hush continued her story, the villagers felt the soothing embrace of drowsiness. Their eyes grew heavy and their thoughts merged with the dream she wove. With serene smiles, they surrendered to the peacefulness of the night. In the quiet village of Whispering Pines, the night was filled with the harmonious sounds of slumber. Hush watched over her dreamers, ensuring their night was cradled in the soft arms of tranquility. And so, in the enchanting cocoon of Hush's storytelling and the whispered serenity of the night, the villagers of Whispering Pines slumbered peacefully, carried away on the wings of their dreams,